The Southern Ocean is a really special place and it's really important to us for a number of reasons. First of all, it's a place where the ocean can take up the heat and carbon that's, that's in the atmosphere and carry it to, to deeper levels that's then distributed through the ocean. So it has, it has this effect of reducing the impact to us on land of global warming. The Southern Ocean is the space between the warm northern parts of, of the world and and the frozen continent of Antarctica. And there are a series of currents that flow around Antarctica through the Southern Ocean that act as barriers to keep that, that heat in the north away from, from the frozen continent. So the Antarctic Circumpolar Current is, is one and the Antarctic Slope Current is another that's, that's closer to Antarctica. So these for, for millennia have um, kept the the heat to the north like a big dam and allowed Antarctica to stay frozen. And there have always been places where that current has been leaky and heat's been able to get through, but we're seeing more evidence that, that more heat's getting through as the, the winds across the Southern Ocean get stronger and more eddies are, are generated. So we're interested to understand the dynamics of these places that are leaky and allow that heat to get through. The focus for our voyage was halfway between Tasmania and Antarctica in one of these really key hotspots for heat leaking across the currents and towards Antarctica. So we, we're worried about heat leaking across the, the currents because that means that more warm water is finding its way towards Antarctica. And recent work has shown that the Antarctic ice shelves and sea ice are vulnerable to the warmer waters that are making their way southward. And so Antarctica holds a, a vast quantity of frozen ice. And, but as the, the ice shelves and sea ice around Antarctica melt away, that removes the buttressing effect of, of these and allows Antarctic glaciers to flow more quickly to the, to the sea and then contribute to faster sea level rise. So understanding the rate that, ocean is, that the ocean is moving heat toward Antarctica and how this is uh, impacting the melt of Antarctic ice is, is one of the key research questions of the international community.